Why did the dog sit next to the fire? Because he wanted to be hot dog. Yes, hello everybody, it is me, Igor from St. Petersburg, and we're gonna learn a new vocabulary through the comedies of Bill Burr. Bill Burr it is a nice comedian, I like him, and it is interesting to know new <laughs> facts. Previous video w with Bill Burr was about uh, crushing women <laughs> to the face. Uh, no, I'm not uh, like a propagandic person who will propagate who will propagand this kind of tools <laughs> against women but let's watch bill burr psycho dog maybe he will punch the dog yes we we will learn new material i gotta tell you though becoming a dad though was the greatest english class okay i gotta tell you though becoming a dad though was the greatest is the greatest fucking thing that ever happened to me, man. It really is. I don't have any jokes about my kid. No, it is. And you're applauding my wife. She did all the work. Yeah. Yeah, knocking a woman up, that's easy. You just, you just have fun. You, unprotected sex, bam, you knock them up, and then they have to deal with it, you know? No matter how much they try to drag you into it, it really is, it's their show, you know? I always say my wife, my, when my wife was pregnant, I would say my wife, you know, she's pregnant. And then I always have these people go, excuse me, you're supposed to say we're pregnant? You're supposed to say we're pregnant? It's like, well, I'm not a seahorse. So, I'm not fucking pregnant. My wife is pregnant. Look at her, she's putting on weight, her feet are swelling up. I didn't understand the joke about seahorse. Seahorse? We are pregnant. I understood joke that he said that I understood story that uh, that when your wife is pregnant you should say that we are pregnant husband and wife but seahorse I didn't catch this joke I'm not fucking pregnant my wife is pregnant look at her. she's putting on weight her feet are swelling up you know she's miserable fucking miserable I'm still doing pull-ups I'm crushing it while being pregnant I'm still drinking smoking yeah <laughs> now the only thing that sucked was I had to get rid of my dog yeah had to find her a new home well I finally had to admit that she was fucking crazy I got a crazy rescue dog and uh, yeah, it was one of these fucking dogs, man. It, it, try, it tried to kill both my parents. It tried to kill my father-in-law. It bit one of my friends. I'd have family come over, friends or whatever. We have to stick it in the back room, like lock the door. And the, like, the first hour, it'd just be throwing itself up against the door. Ah, I'll fucking kill all you motherfuckers. I'll kill all you motherfuckers. Looking under the door, I can see your feet. I know what you smell like. I'll follow you home. I'll find you. I'll fucking kill all of you. And we were just in like total denial, like, no, she's just a little, you know, a little scared because she was abused. D denial, denial, what is denial? Ah, denial means uh, the action of declaring something to be untrue, okay? And we got like a trainer and all of that shit, and he finally just said, listen, man, this is one of these dogs nature said no to, but people said yes to. So I'm like, Jesus Christ, you could have told me that 10,000 fucking dollars ago, you know? <laughs> so now my wife, she's five months pregnant. She's six months, seven, eight months pregnant. It's just the fucking, this, this thing just hanging over my head. And finally, I just said to my wife, I'm like, we got to do something about this, man. I'm not going to be this guy in the news being like, well, you know, uh, the dog loved me and my wife, so I figured it'd be all right to let it sleep near the bassinet. And well, you can imagine my surprise the next morning. Yeah, I wasn't gonna be that guy in the news whose dog ate his baby, right? I gotta get rid of this thing. So we call my trainer and he goes, all right, I'll take it, okay? So thank God they're not gonna put the dog down or anything like that, so I'm like, thank God. So he goes, I'll come back in a week. And it was very sad because we both love this dog, like, like with all our hearts, right? Did I understand right uh, that uh, right now story about pregnancy of uh, his wife and uh, about one more dog, like from the Mask Second. Mask Second, do you know this movie? When Son of Mask, it's with Jim Carrey, or not? No, without Jim Carrey, Jim Carrey from First Mask. And uh, in Second, uh, we have uh, like a Son of Mask, Son of uh, like Jim Actor, Jim Carrey Actor, and uh, Okay, whatever. And uh, this story about dog, husband, 
and wife and one more secret secret poison inside of your stomach right and what amazed me though was over that week the way my wife handled grief versus me it was so mature she just like took it on I just went into denial. I was just like, well, I'm not giving it away tomorrow, so I'm not going to think about it. I just called the dog up in the bed, started petting her and lashing out at people for no fucking reason, right? <laughs> My wife, on the other hand, she just went right into the bathroom that night. She was brushing her teeth. I could just hear her quietly crying like, hoo hoo, hoo hoo, hoo hoo. I swear to God, I was on the bed and I literally, I got mad at her. I didn't yell at her, just, I had it just internal, you know? And I was just thinking like, why is she having the proper emotion? in this fucking moment. Why isn't she just blocking it out the fucking way I am, right? Just don't deal with it until you fucking give it away and then just start yelling at people the, the, the way I do, right? And that's what we did. I just blocked it out and every night she would cry a little bit more the whole week, <laughs> till the night before she's like, <laughs> right? And what I didn't realize was she had cried herself into acceptance. And meanwhile, my emotions were still at the starting line. And then there's a knock at the door and she goes, okay, he's here, go get the dog. And I'm like, hey, Cleo. And she popped her head up and I saw her wagging her fucking tail. And all of a sudden, eight years of conditional love all started bubbling up. And I was like, oh, fuck, not now, not now. <laughs> so I just pushed it down. I just walked at her like some weird game show host. Hey, how are you? One, one moment, I didn't understand. Uh, jo dog jumped on her uh, ball of stomach one moment starting line self into acceptance and meanwhile my emotions were still at the starting line and then there's a knock at the door and she goes okay he's here go go get the dog okay i understood that uh, she was on bathroom she he was outside of bathroom and uh, right now she said like uh, hey call the dog and dog should go to her yes go get the dog and i'm like hey cleo and she popped her head up popped her head up means that uh, was uh, so with amazement and marvelous and uh, dog was marvelous and i saw her wagging her fucking tail and wagging tail means that uh, side to side all of a sudden, eight years of conditional love all started bubbling up. And it means uh, that inside of fucking tail, and all of a sudden, eight years of conditional love, eight years of conditional love all started bubbling up. And I, I was like, oh, fuck, not now. It was like uh, he wanted to to vomit or what? Not now! <laughs> so I just pushed it down. I just walked at her like some weird game show host. Hey, how are you? I'm smiling for no reason, all right? Now we're going for a walk. I'm just gonna say what we're doing so I don't think about what I'm feeling. And I just walked out, handed the leash to the new owner, pet her on the head, didn't even look her in the eye because I knew I couldn't and just turned around and walked away from something that I loved more than I had loved anything in my life up to that point. Don't tell my wife, right? <laughs> so then I come back into the house. Ah, means that uh, he, he took a duck, this duck, and uh, gave the duck to friend or trainer, yes? House, all right, and she's just looking at me. She knows I'm out of my fucking mind. She's like, are you okay? Is everything all right? Do you want to talk about it? We can go out, get something to eat or something. I'm like, I'm like, no, I'm fine. Sometimes you have to be up here and think logical and not be in your heart. I'm just going to go into the bathroom for a second. And I went in and I closed the door and for 0.8 seconds cried like a little boy before phew, I put the lid back on the jar, <laughs> fastened it back and just added it to the shelf of anger that sits in every man's chest. Yeah. And I couldn't help but wonder in that moment, who that I love in my life is going to pay for that in the future? <laughs> like, where am I going to be? Family reunion, bed, bath, and beyond. How many fucking towels do we need? Jesus Christ, it's a fucking sickness with you. 
Where is this coming from? I just don't understand where this is coming from. I didn't understand fully. I haven't understood, uh, but you can help me with leaving comment section below. But right now I will do some maybe what benedictions. No, how to say it? It means that you are uh, one moment prediction prediction some prediction i will give for you prediction that uh, maybe the story was guessing 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 about the story maybe the story was yes about son a uh, son means uh, this small person children child child inside of woman plus dog plus uh, our comedian man and trainer trainer it is opposite person it is uh, no n n it is uh, no one it is uh, like a uh, nobody nobody and uh, what's the joke what's the point of joke uh, yes he gave this dog dog was so awful he was uh, like always running to every person and why about what the story <laughs> i did understand sorry but uh, if you will write me in the comment section i will understand it correct maybe i did understand this we have three characters pregnant woman husband and dog so motherfucker psycho dog and uh, dog always was running and uh, he did something not good for female because female was pregnant and when you are pregnant you should be more uh, you should be less emotional man who likes so who who liked or disliked duck if he liked duck i understood this joke if he disliked duck i didn't understand okay thanks a lot for watching hope you enjoyed if you did uh, leave me in the comment section it is not like a so funny video it is uh, something learning video fair use of content educational pers purposes from from english comedians thanks a lot see you next time and you know that all depends on learning in your whole entire life bye bye